I have an appointment. My assistant was supposed to reschedule. She didn't. You better call her then. Mom said you're not allowed to reschedule with me. Please, just this once. Don't be a putz. Putz? I worked 80 hours this week. What did you do? <laughs> Just don't do this, okay? Your mom can play these games with you, okay? I, I've never been any good at this anyhow. You can do this, Dad. Oh, no! What?
Bedtime, Princess Moomba. It's time to get your beauty rest. Your Majesty has blessed the land with your beauty today. It's quiet now, and the journey will continue tomorrow. Yeah! The rebels have infiltrated the base! Yeah! Yeah! Bam! Boom! Sir Lawrence! Sir Lawrence! Send in the cavalry! Quick! Sir Lawrence! Sir Lawrence! What happened to you? No! Why? 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 Emma, you're not in there playing, are you? That's a very convincing snore, but you'll have to turn your light off, young lady. Thank you. Good night, Grandma. Good night, sleep talker.
Well, it's one of the most anticipated IPOs of the year. Apollo Systems, the market leader in emerging technology and mobile delivery systems, is receiving a new underwriter from the season. Word on the street is that Hanley Capital, Jim Buster Classic Company, and Hamilton Partners are all in the front running for this game. It's going to be quite a new contest, and you can imagine when you say they learn that the registration thing is sometime soon, David, you down at the topic? I hate that pants shitting terror look. Jeff. What is it, man? I'm not gonna kill you. You know, you We're are gonna survive the morning. We're in a serious crunch here, John. We're never in a crunch, Roger, ever. Word is that Apollo is leaning toward Hamilton. Hamilton came in last night and then lowballed the feet down to hey, six and a half hey, percent. Hey. What, what? Six and a half percent, John. They snaked us early. Hamilton? On the Apollo? Are you talking about the Apollo J Yes. Hamilton did six and a half on Apollo? They came in and they lowballed us. Where'd you get this? Carl's contact. Let them do that. It's, it's anyone's guess. You, you know, personally, I, I thought it was a little bit too far-fetched. Fucking then... bucket shop. Apollo wants Hamilton. Hamilton couldn't find a fat man in a county fair. Fuck Hamilton. Fuck him. They want to win the bid on a percentage play, but they're going to have to do better than that. Good luck. Sir. This is desperate. I know these guys all too well. This is a desperate fucking move. Listen, Roger. This deal falls through this morning? And I will kill you with my own bare hands.
Branch. One, two, three, branch! Hello, dirt. And how are we today? Nope. Don't have the face of a fighter, do we? You're Jacob. My name's Alel. I'm told I'm supposed to assist you. You're able to help with the girl who was taken? Wait. You're the one that got your ass kicked. What? Yeah, I bet that doesn't sit too well with you. Of course, a uh, good ass kicking doesn't sit well with anyone. Uh, are you mocking me? You're sharp, too, aren't you? <laughs> I get it. I get it. I'll play along. You don't want word to get out, do you? What word? About your ass kicking. You know, no one knows that you're actually a priss. They're all fooled, but you really are a priss. Is it your policy to let adorable little girls disappear into the That's night? That's enough. Oh! Chord has been struck. Do we have a guilty child neglector here? Oh! <laughs> there it is. The fighter. <laughs> Just had to be sure, you know. Of course, she's roughing up the handicap, but who's counting? We meet again. Look, is this a joke? Do you actually have a purpose to do just talk trash? You lost the girl, no, right? No, I didn't lose the girl. Sure, sure, she was kidnapped. There's still time before all is lost. You have a way to track him. Hell no, and who wants to? Remember, he kicked your ass. Go around the other side, we'll find the physical girl. And do what? Shake the shit out of her! <laughs> Shake the shit out of her. <clears throat> we'll wake her up. It's just great. Last time I checked, there's no way to physically affect them unless you're. You're a pathfinder.
I need help. I have a delivery. My key was broken. Were you a failure, Inc? No. Because failure is not an option with us, Inc. Only perfection. Yes, I can. Would you like help, Inc? You need it. With that shame. That stench. isn't here. It's broken into two. The carriers are drifters. But they are loyal. Find each of them, and you'll have access to the assembly. Best keep your pacing. You only have a few hours. Fail now, and you need not go on. You only have one opportunity. To become numb. Consider, I think I'd rather be rich, man. Uh huh. Uh huh. Hey, Phil. Yeah, I gotta go. Yeah, I gotta get to the pitch. Okay. I'm sorry. He said it was an emergency. What are you doing here? I couldn't get you on the phone. If I wanted to talk to you, Ron, I would have taken your call. Emma's in the hospital. They say it's just had some kind of seizure. She okay? She's alive. But she's not been responsive. She's in a coma now. What are they doing for? Well, they're trying to keep her stable, but they... They said it's possible that... This has weakened her heart, they say it's... It's possible that she could just cycle over to cardiac arrest. Emma needs you. Kathy and I are with her, but... But she does. She needs her father. That's not my place anymore. We have to let that go. For your daughter. What can I do now? I'm asking you, Ron, what can I do now? I'm good enough to be your father now? You have to let that go. It's in the past now. Is it? Well, it's very fucking present for me, Ron. You know, you convinced the world I'm the Antichrist, and you take her from me. You can't throw that in the past, Ron, because that's where I live now. I know that you've suffered with this we oh, all no, have. Please. Look, I am I don't want to hear it. I don't want to hear it. I don't even have a daughter anymore, remember? Those words ring a bell. John, I'm sorry. Mr. Hudson is asking for I know, Judith. I know.
You need to go. This is not the time. I didn't come here for that. You want to talk about lives, Ron? Well, I'm at the point of life and death on a multi-billion dollar deal. And thousands of lives are at stake. And that's important. And that's my family now. That's all I have we left. We did what we thought was best for her, but, but she needs you now. Consider your obligation as her father. This insignificant man. Obligation? What's obligation to you? You don't talk to Shelly for 15 years, and then you show up at her fucking funeral? Is that the obligation you're talking about, Ron? Huh? You know, taking care of Emma doesn't somehow absolve you of all that shit! You could have killed You're him. still a fraud. You live with that every day, don't you? I'm trying to keep you from making the same mistake. Ah, fuck you, Ron. I am not you. Do you understand me? Don't play the old wise man with me. This is not about me and you, John. This is about your daughter. Get out. I'm asking I you, John. I will not wait for security to throw you out. She's a Luton hospital. They all grovel now. Thank you for your order, sir. Confirmation's in the mail. I just sold five million of our new Bowman Pipeline junk bonds. Yeah! Hey, you work for me, don't you? John Sullivan? Scott Hamilton. Scott Hamilton. Scott yeah. Hamilton. Heard you moved some big money down the pen. Five million's a big ticket. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Got lucky, I guess. I don't know. Hey, Todd. Do you remember the Sable High Yield account you threw back into the pot? I just sold him three million at Rummy Casino. I hate you. Johnny! Hey, buddy, how are you? Word is that Scott Hamilton has his eye on you. Huh? That you might be moving into a corner office soon, huh? Unbelievable. You're here two and a half years, and you get a view of downtown. You know what I got? Feel my own demise. <laughs> Hey, hey, talk of the town, John Sullivan. <laughs> this is ridiculous. How many nights are you gonna do this? Hey, we had a great day today. I mean, we, we just had to celebrate. Look at me. What? This has got to stop. You can't be absent all the time. She hated your success. You have a whole other life that you are forgetting. suffered an immense amount of grief. So it saddens me to have to create any more. However, I feel with your history of drug abuse and your negligent behavior regarding your daughter, it's important that you be given some time to re-examine your life. I see you're currently unfit. Unfit. Care for your daughter. Therefore, it is the order of the court. They stole her. The custody of Emma Sullivan be awarded to Ronald and Catherine Evans. No! Damn it! <laughs> Let me help you. No, don't touch me. Don't touch a thing, please. Asshole. So, uh, I'm a little confused about the plan here. Yeah, you and me both. As far as I know, we're supposed to try to recover her from the other side, physically wake her, and pull her back. And we do that how? I don't know. Today we're just escorts for him. He's a pathfinder. 
You're a Pathfinder? Yeah, I wouldn't try to have a real rational conversation with him, Sarah, or even a pleasant one. Oh, and he has wandering hands. Ouch, two, three, four. All right. We do this carefully and quietly. We pack light, so, uh, don't fight, okay? Okay, he just needs to observe right now. He studies the scene, we watch his back. Now we have no idea if this girl is being guarded, so it's imperative that we keep quiet. We get seen, we have more hate than we can handle. Grandmother's in the room. She's doing what? Standing. And she's looking She's at... looking out the window. Keep describing. Her grandmother's looking at Emma now. She's touching her forehead. This girl's parents.
Someone want to fill me in? Our inside man says Hamilton put in an after hours wine and dine. Says they offered up six and a half at 17. Our inside man, have mercy. We've turned into the CIA. <laughs> Hamilton's a joke. They're on their last legs. We can beat this. John, how the hell are we gonna beat this? We all know they're gonna bring the offer to market using the usual syndicate, and now they're making sure Apollo... That's been the problem all along. All right? We simply cannot compete with their trifecta. For the love of fuck, people, why do we want to forfeit before the game? Huh? Let's pick up the bat and take a few swings. Look, letting this one slide is just not an option. It's not on the table, okay? We are there. We will take it. We can always work the numbers. We could substantiate an offer at 18. Be a little creative. I love this woman. I love this woman. That's what I'm talking about. A little creativity. It's bullshit. This was nothing to you. This has got to stop. You can't get this at all. It's about self-image, guys. It's just about how they perceive themselves. Apollo is high as a kite right now. So we indulge that. They want numbers, we'll give them some numbers. How solid is this? Solid. Okay. So we meet Hamilton six and a half. We offer up a firm commitment. $18.50. No one's gonna fuck with that. John, that's a pretty big stretch. Dan. I will sell this. I will sell this. And just affirm what they already believe. These guys think they're God? Let's give them some numbers that agree. They worship you. of trash do you come from? <laughs> Don't listen to him, John. Don't listen to him, John. You are better than that. You are better than that. We need the big guns. If all goes peachy, we will. Quiet. Get back. Damn it! <laughs> Let me help you. No, don't touch it. Don't touch a thing. He's ahead of us. He's walking to his car, and there's an incubus shadowing him. What does the incubus look like? Large. Collected. What is an incubus doing with him during the day? What does it mean? It means this guy is fucked.
he's not good. What do you think? Does he seem bad to you, Emma? You know my name. I know a lot about you. How? When you go to sleep at night, do you like having dreams? Well, when you sleep, people like me come. And we give you and your family and everyone you know good dreams. Does he give nightmares? Not yet he doesn't. Quiet! that belong to me and they will not be taken unless they are replaced by something of greater value. You want payment? Mm -hmm. ah! Ah! Payment will be your life. No, my life, my life, no, no, no. For my things to be taken must replaced and doubled. My life? Mm. No, no, that's, that's, that's not of adequate value. Mm. Those are mine. Two. Yeah, three of those are mine. <clears throat> so, assembly codes? Hmm? This way. <laughs> so, you've uh, come here for, for codes, have you? Well, I have codes! <laughs> some, some, somewhere. Um... <laughs> ah! <laughs> Assembly codes. <laughs> Somewhere. Ah! Assembly codes. <laughs> mm -hmm. 
Mm. How did you get the big prize? Oh, she, she, she's worth quite a lot, I hear. I can take her off your hands for you. Leave the storyteller. $10,000 PowerPoint here. All the bells and whistles. Showing you why we are the greatest, the most reliable, yada, yada, yada. But this meeting isn't about us. This, this meeting is about you. It's about how you guys are going to be the, the biggest, biggest company, company in the world. In the world. <laughs> delivery systems. I'm giving them an hour. They agreed to 1850 and everything we set forth. As long as I show up with the final paperwork and a bottle of champagne, we're in business. She's won, Bob. You know what? I don't get this. I don't get you. I don't get this mission. What are we even doing here? We're wasting our time. A child is going to die. You're burning our time. Death is the least of her troubles. That's right. You know what? You're right. So let's help her. You know, the downward spiral is essentially a chain reaction. And nothing that comes out of your mouth makes any sense. They're all reactions. One thing begets the next. A man has a weakness. He's flawed. That flaw leads him to guilt. The guilt leads him to shame. The shame he compensates with pride and vanity. And when pride fails, despair takes over and they all lead to his destruction. What will become his fate? Something's gotta stop the flow. He's on his way. The girl needs her father. And we're going to deliver him. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four.
This man got robbed. Too good. Yeah, usually I can get it to start. Unfortunately, I'm not too good with cars, but this is the engine, right? Okay. Ah, right. uh, look at this. Yeah, right here. What? This is your problem right here. Oh, thank goodness. Ah, uh, check this out. Mm -hmm. Yeah, try starting her up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That was bad. Sorry, that was bad. <laughs> no, that was good. No, no, that was bad. You were so cute. I was so nervous. <laughs> Why? I don't know. I guess I was humbled by you. No, no, no. no. I love you, Johnny. <laughs> Johnny! Get away from me, you freak. Are you here? What do you mean? I know who you are, storyteller. This is a trap! You set me up! Ah, killer! Ah, killer's all right whoa, here! Whoa, whoa, I'm the one in chains here. Remember, Sparky? I'm the one who's unarmed. Liar! You're confused by your own paranoia. Who is this girl? Why do you care about this child? You are in complete control. What is it you're so afraid of? Ah! <laughs> entry was painful. Remember. You can see nothing. They'll be gone soon. At the assembly. When you become one of them. You've been given promises of beauty and bliss in exchange for your soul. This girl. She's your ticket. They told you, bring her to the table and you become one of them. Numb to your pain. They told you to take her as a sacrifice? That's all she is. There's nothing in you that sees something else. I have no sympathy. 
sympathy for their kind. Don't try to manipulate my emotions. I don't have any. I'm not interested in manipulation. Just in revealing the truth, but you can't accept it. I accept what's real. You can't even accept yourself. Why do you hide under that cloak? You reek of guilt. Guilt comes from someone with a soul. Words. A storyteller. Where's your army? I have no army, Eve. I'm alone. No one is coming for me. There's no trap. Hers, my fate, are in your hands. You will not stop me. This girl will go to the assembly. Sadie loves visitors, and they love to visit me. They love to take my picture, love to see me smile. They ask about me all the time. What is she doing? Who is she with? <laughs> Where have they all gone? But here you are, my audience. My name is Ink. Who is this? Her ugliness disgusts me. I am Ink. These are my prisoners. I have a delivery for the assembly. I need part of a code. I will speak with you, but not in her presence. <laughs> oh, I can't do it. Oh! <laughs> it's <getting> there. We're not well liked here. Who's she? She is a drifter. She was once a person. And when she died, she came here. But she wanders around not knowing a place. She's not a storyteller like me. Or an incubus. She refuses both sides. Like ink. How long have you been a storyteller? How long? <laughs> well. Depends on how you measure time. For us, time doesn't work the same as it does for you. We live in two different timelines. She's cutting your hair. She wants your hair for part of the code. You'll give it to her. It's yours. I won't tell anybody I took it from some cheap bag. <laughs> of course, in the right light. <laughs> in the right light, no one notices anything. 
when they light me, it's as though I were still shivering almost, <laughs> reflecting every gaze. <laughs> <laughs> That's enough. in my sight, but I can hear the beat. The beat? Beat of the world. All part of the song, I just hear the music. You can physically change the path of people's lives. That's what they say. You think you'll be okay? Sure. A little physical damage can be good. Shake the shit out of them. We say. He's convinced himself he's God. We're just reminding him he's not. It takes humility to remember who we are. If he embraces his shame, she has a chance. If not, the girl will be lost. That can't happen. Better get moving, big boy. She doesn't have much time.
don't you fight. You're letting this happen. You're a warrior. You should fight. Fighting would only blind you further. Do you like my hair? It's all the rage right now. How do you feel? Lost. You were in a car accident. You have a nice little concussion. Just go ahead and relax, and the doctor will be with you in a moment, okay? Where am I? You're at Lutheran Hospital.
on, John. We need help, I'm launching the pop. Do it. What's going on? The remote. It's it's not working. Damn it! It has to be launched from the base then. Go, Alela. We'll hold him off as long as we can. He won't make it without me. I'll go. Wow! <laughs> Crazy blind bastard on the loose! One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. I'll stay with him. Buy me as much time as you can. It's not gonna be much. which is one floor up into the left. Okay? Change is complete. I see Lioness. At first I wasn't sure, but then suddenly I 
notice something. Look how brave you've become. The little girl I met is no more. She's now the most ferocious creature on Earth. I knew I was right. When I die, will I be a storyteller like you? No, you'll be far greater than that. You'll be much more beautiful. Will I get to see my mom again? Yes, you will, sweetie. You have proved your loyalty. Those scars, they will be gone now. No more shame. Because pride is what we are made of. You will be our greatest asset. Because 
it said. You can undo what's already been done. Suicide, wasn't it? Thank <sighs> you. 